Hello and welcome. This is Christy Haig with a tutorial for you from digitalscrapbookingclasses.com. I'm excited today to share with you a cool new trick that I found um, that I believe is new to Photoshop Elements 10, and that is the ability to write text within a shape. Now we're going to start by going down here to the shape tools. There's the rectangle, um, the circle, all of these different shapes. Um, this trick will for sure work with the rectangle and the circles, um, and I'm finding that it works with quite a few of the custom shapes, although not all of them. So I pick the custom shape tool and go up here, and I'm going to select the heart because I know it works with that. Um, I did try it with this flower, and for some reason it didn't work, so I'm guessing it works with some of these custom shapes, but not all of them. So we're going to try the heart. And I'm going to go here and draw my heart. And I'm holding the shift key down on the keyboard to make it um, nicely proportioned. If I let go of the shift key, I can scrunch it up. But with holding the shift key down, I can make a nice proportioned heart. And then I'm simply going to click on the text tool. Now this is just this horizontal text tool option, the normal text tool that you use. And because the shape I have is black, I'm going to pick a white um, text color. And I'm just going to go here, and you'll see that when I hover over the shape, it turns into this sort of rounded text icon. And if I click like this, it will select the heart shape that I have drawn. And all I need to do then is type out the text. And just like normal when you do text, click the green check mark. And just like um, any sort of text, I can also go and change font sizes or spacing. I liked it better with the 30. Um, and I can also move it around a little bit to get it to fit more of the way I want. So there you have it. Um, like I said, you pick the shape, you draw the shape, you keep the shape um, unsimplified, and then with the shape layer selected in the layers palette, choose the text layer, type it out, and it will fill that shape. Have fun! For more tutorials and classes in digital scrapbooking, head over to digitalscrapbookingclasses.com. Have fun and keep scrapping memories.